Piper, come. Squirm. Yes. Good doggy. Go squirm. Oh no. <laughs> Sorry. Rawr, rawr, rawr. Sorry. You're okay, baby bean. There you go. Good girly. You're so great. There you go. Yes, you. You did it. Good dog. Give me a kiss. Yes. My girl. You did it. My girl. Ready, set, squirm. Good girl. Ready, set, squirm. Good girl. And squirm. Good. We got you a real one. Ready, squirm. Good job, Very nice, baby bean. Piper, squirm. Good. Over here, I threw some food on the ground so Piper can de-stress. We made a little station here next to the picnic table she's going to jump on. Which we're using today, they're just her kibble. If your dog can't focus with just the kibble, that means you're way too close or they're way too overstimulated. Piper is hot because she just finished training parkour with me. I wanted to go home, but I saw he had his dogs out, so we might as well take this opportunity to work on her reactivity. There's the UPS truck. It's um, it just went by. I don't know if you can see. I'll kind of zoom in a bit. I know it seems really far away, but it was um going back and it was going from here to here earlier, and um, that used to be very triggering for Piper. She used to have very very just everything stressed her out. So yeah, the guy with the dogs, he's still out there. He's actually not within the camera's view or anything, but I don't want to risk having his dogs react. Cause um, just because they're not at the same point in Piper's training doesn't mean I need to ruin their day. Now he's walking three reactive dogs at once, so it is nice. Now the, the UPS truck is closer and there's another car. She, you see that look away and look back at us that she just did there? She started it again. There was a car that was pretty close by. But see, she's looking, yes, and she looks right back at her mommy. She is so tired. She's gonna sleep for maybe five minutes. 